Good afternoon everyone. Today, Wild Badger sent me a handheld blower and we're going to check it out. I've been working in my shop for several days on a new bench, new workbench that is, and uh, I have sawdust around this whole garage everywhere. So uh, I'm going to blow this thing all out, try this all out. Um, oh nice, real nice. Looks like this is going to get really low to the ground. Oh, I'm liking it so far. Let's see this. Huh. What you got me, a new toy? Yeah, I got you a new toy. Okay, so. Cool. I either got the flat. Or this, so I've got to believe I'm going to use this in my shop. Vicky using the Well Badger electric blower. blower. Uh, it's got some uh, meat to it. As of right now, not bad, not bad. It's got a nice little curve to it. Pretty slick. That is nice. There, and it's locked. So that's a pretty good length on that. That's a really good length because most of them stop about here. Now that's kind of nice. I like that. Oh, and the Wild Badger's got the automatic on after you shut it off. So, uh, yeah, I've liked them so far. Let's see. Uh, English side. Move the choke lever to the start position. Yep. Oh, it's even got a cruise control on the side. There we go. That works nice. Uh, pull starter, press and release primer bulb. Sometimes pull store, starter cord three to five times until ignition is heard. Move the choke lever to the run position. Continue pulling the starter cord until engine runs. Yeah, that's normal. That's not cool. Uh, what do we got? Your plastic lever for something and your basic tools. So let's see what the manual says. Give a good uh, breakdown of what this has for CFMs and uh, horsepower. I don't know if it's going to give the CFMs, but it'll give the miles per hour, I think. Oh, there's something else in there. Thank you for your purchase. If you need support, get a running email, support team, and there's a, yeah. So, uh... Let's see, model number WB26CCHHBL. Product name, fuel driven handy vacuum blower, 25.4 CFMs. No, piston displacement, 25.4. Power, 0.8. Fuel tank volume, 400 milliliters, I guess. Uh, maximum air speed, 266. Uh, oil ratio, 50 to 1. Suction capacity for vacuum, which there's no vacuum on there. Um, what's, there? what's this here? Huh. There is an attachment there. So this cover does come off, pop open, and so I can clean that up. Uh, noise is 74 decibels, and uh, the weight is uh, kilograms. 4.6, whatever that equals out to, um, in pounds, because I don't know. Your warranty 
Let's see, United States Protection Agency, same manufacturers, mission control, mission systems are warrantied for two years as here and then notified. Okay. Manufacturers of mission control. Let's see what the regular warranty. Uh, did not give me the regular warranty, but I believe there's a two year warranty on this, but I'll check. Because that said the emissions, so I don't know if it's the all the way around. All the way around? Yeah. Air cleaner. Let's pull the air cleaner off of this. See what kind of air cleaner we got. Oh, just your basic air filter. Foam. Oh yeah, this is a pretty nice one. This is really nice. It's about normal. Normal? Yeah, about normal. There we go. Boy, that's a little tough to get in there out of there, but... of a struggle there. Okay. Don't think that's supposed to come off. Okay. Gasket wasn't all the way down, it's not a biggie. 50 to 1. This thing's got some compression. control up a little bit. I don't so high. Put this other notch on. Other notch on. There we go. Nice. Yeah, I don't like this one. I like the other one better.
after using this for five, ten minutes in my driveway and my uh, shop and everything, which it did clean it out pretty nice, and did clean up the driveway pretty nice, you know, this is a little bit heavier than I would like. Um, it's about twice the weight as what I normally do use, and uh, it does have about the same amount of power. Um, the other thing I don't like is uh, I am right-handed, so this is up against my right leg, you know, th this part here, and every time I uh, get close to uh, my pant leg, it sucks it all up in there, and then this vent. Yeah, I don't like the vent. I got gas all over me from tip, tipping it around, so, you know, whatever. It's not a big deal. It's going to stay in my garage, and uh, that's going to be it for me for today. Hope you liked today's video. Please comment, like, subscribe, and click the notification bell for when the next video is released. And if you want to purchase this, the links will be down in the description. Everybody have a good night, and we'll see you on the next one.